My name is Aida. I am the daughter of King Amanasro. The Black Land was a beautiful and peaceful place. An abundant land full of vitality, where the people lived without worries. People worked the fertile land, where crops grew with amazing speed. Then one day, I finally found the son of the Black Lamb. <laughs> I'll have to be careful. Yeah, the sun is mine. <laughs> of our black land has been stolen. That's how we lost our son. The black land became covered in darkness and desolate. <sighs> how will we retrieve our lost son? They won't get away with this. This means war. <laughs> Your Majesty, the land of the sun is stronger. <clears throat> We do not have enough soldiers for war. We are not yet prepared to go to war. Is there nothing we can do to retrieve the sun? Please, Please forgive, forgive us. us! Father, I'll bring back the sun. You? Father, I will bring back the sun from the land of the sun. Aida, it's too dangerous. <sighs> But without the sun, we will all die of starvation and cold. Please, Father, let me go. Hmm. The gods will be with you. Take care, my daughter, Aida. I'll bring back the sun, no matter what. <sighs> Thus... I embarked on my journey to find our lost son. The wind is so strong. I can't go forward. to reach the land of the sun, no matter what. I must go on. I have to get up. I have to find the sun. But first, 
I'll lie here and rest. looking bird. Uh, come hither, little bird. I guess he won't come to me either. I can have anything I want, but I can't have the heart of the one I love. Oh, Radebees! 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 of this land must know where they're hiding the sun. Where could it be? Maybe it's here? It must be around here somewhere. No, it's not here either. Maybe it's here then? The princess is back. What shall I do? Oh, Radamis, couldn't you hear me as I beckoned? Oh. Oh, who's there? Oh. Huh? Oh. Your Highness, I am your new servant, Aida. My new mm. servant? Oh, the beautiful bird must be gone. I hoped it would stay with me. Oh. Oh. Shall I brush your hair, Your Highness? I could cheer you up. Oh, Ida, at least you seem to understand me. Oh. I decided to become the princess's servant girl in order to look for our lost son. The jewels to wear during the festival of the sun. Hmm. 
Your Highness. Mm, no, it's not beautiful enough. Your Highness. I don't like it. That is truly beautiful, Ida. This is perfect. Your Highness. I don't like it. Your Highness. I don't like that either. Yes, I love that dress. It's you again, Ida. I proclaim the start of the festival. I scoured the palace while the guards were making merry during the festival. But to no avail. I became increasingly desperate. Oh, will I ever be able to find our son? The people here have plenty to eat and drink. But my people are starving. Oh. This place is so peaceful. Countless people lost their lives in war in order to bring this peace. Oh, what's that? What a strange looking bird. And why do you cry on this auspicious day? Who are you? Who wields both a flute and a sword? I am a warrior and musician. The flute and sword are my friends. Why do you call those things your friends? I need them both to protect my country. One to slay my enemies with, and the other to sing of victory. You raid other countries and mock the pain of the conquered. Do you think that is just? Your gallant words are but a lie. My name is Radames. I don't think I've seen you around here. What is your name? I am Aida, the princess's servant girl. I apologize for being too forward. <sighs> anyway, why were you sitting here alone, crying? Uh, I've just been troubled by something, that's all. Tell me what it is. Uh. Tell me what it is.
had started a war to find me and the son of my land. Sorry, Ida, but I must hurry back to the palace. Uh, oh, wait! Uh, oh, Radames! I shall be back, my love. My father has attacked? What am I going to do now? of the Black Land has invaded us. Who shall repel their attack and bring us glory? The gods will tell us who to send. <sighs> the god of victory has spoken. The general we shall send is... Radamis! Yes, sir. Radamis! I put thee in command of the army. You must win the war and save your country. If you return victorious, I will bestow you with a great gift. If Radamis returns victorious, father will surely allow me to marry him. If I return victorious from war, Pharaoh will allow me to marry Aida. I shall return victorious no matter what! to my land if Radames wins? What will happen to Radames if my father wins? Oh, who should I pray for? My father or Radames? Attack the enemy! found the sun sooner, this war would have never occurred. Oh, where in the world is our sun? Take that! Oh, I can't find the sun. Where could they be hiding it? Oh... Dear Radimus, the battlefield is a dangerous place. I cannot sleep for fear that you will lose your life. You are safe, aren't you, my beloved? Oh, I trust you. I trust that you will come back safely. Oh. What's the sound? This is the sound of Radimus's flute. What's going on? 
playing Radimus's flute. <sighs> oh, Radimus, I long for your return, my love. Ida, I'm so worried for his safety. <gasps> I'm going to marry him as soon as he returns victorious. I'm sure Radimus will be greatly pleased. Oh, my love, Radimus. Oh, no, he's my love. Oh, my, why do you wear such a sad expression, Ida? Tell me what troubles you. <laughs> it's because of the foolish greed of your country. <laughs> Is it because you have what does not belong to you? What doesn't belong to me? You and your people took our son when you had a son of your own. It is you who have what does not belong to you. <laughs> This is a letter sent from the front lines. I wonder what news it holds. News of victory or defeat? Maybe it contains news of Redimus. The Black Land is victorious. <gasps> uh, and General Radimus has been slain by the enemy? Radimus is dead? My dear Radimus? <gasps> what did you say, Your Highness? <sighs> Radamis has been slain? Is this true, your highness? <sighs> What's the matter with you? Why should you be so devastated to hear that Radamis has been slain? Uh, I... Uh, I merely mourn the loss of a great general. That's all. <sighs> Listen carefully, Ida. Radamis is mine, and I will never allow anyone else to have him. Do you understand? <clears throat> Radamis is still alive, and the army of our land is victorious. While I breathed a sigh of relief that Radamis was safe, my heart broke for my poor father. You're safe. give you the greatest reward of all! I'll tell him I want to marry Aida. Sire, may I speak? Radamis! Marry my daughter and become ruler of <laughs> my land! <laughs> we will celebrate this royal union for four days and four nights. Drink and be merry to celebrate this grand occasion! Radamis is to marry the princess? What will I do now? I no longer know what I'm doing here. I could not find our son, and I have even lost the man I love to another. My father must be so worried about me, and my people must be suffering from hunger and drought. Between the handsome general and the beautiful princess is tomorrow. It'll be the most beautiful and splendid wedding in the world. That's right. I bless the union between the victorious general and our princess. The general and the princess make a lovely couple. I can't wait. <sighs> Ida? Oh. 
15 cartloads of cloths will be used for tomorrow's wedding. And 10 cartloads of flowers. And 5 cartloads of jewels. Oh, it will truly be a splendid wedding. Don't you think, Ida? Here, oh. Ida. Take this. Oh. Oh. Here. See you, Ida. Oh. Aida. Oh, Radamis, it's you. Oh. I have something to say to you. Meet me tonight at the Papyrus Garden. Please, come, Aida. I'll be waiting for you. I've missed you so much, Aida. and captured my father. Moreover, he is to marry the princess tomorrow. My daughter. Oh, 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 father, you're safe. Oh. I went to great lengths to save you, only to learn that you are in love with the enemy general. Oh, I deserve to die, father. Get up. <laughs> Aida, do not be sad and listen to my words. There is a way. You can save both your beloved Radamis and your people. What do you mean? Please tell me, Father. You must find out where our son is from Radamis. What? Aida! I will never marry the princess. I will beseech Pharaoh when the day breaks. I will tell him that I want to marry you. So please, wait until then. The Pharaoh will never give his consent. You will only earn his wrath. <sighs> Pharaoh is merciful. He will grant me my wish, so please wait. The princess will never let you go. Then what should we do? Let us run away together. That is the only way. Let us do that. Though it pains me to leave my homeland, I will sacrifice anything in order to be with you, my love. <sighs> but if you disappear, the Pharaoh will send his men after us. <sighs> we must go somewhere where the sun does not shine. <sighs> what will we do, Radamis? Do not worry, Aida. We will escape through the temple in Napata Valley. The sun of the Black Land is hidden there. Our sun does not shine there. So, it's the Napata Valley. So that's where you've hidden our sun. Who are you? <gasps> I am Amenasro, the king of the Black Land. I am Aida's father. Uh, Aida's father? Then Aida is the princess of the Black Land? Is this true, Aida? Oh. I have divulged an important Come secret us, to the enemies. Marry Aida and become the ruler of the Black Land. Omnasro! Mm -hmm. You will never get away with this! Stand back, Radamis! I will not! 
Stand back at once, or be arrested for treason! Get out of here, Aida! Go! What are you waiting for? Arrest them! Yes, your highness! Halt! Take another step, and I will be forced to kill you! Run, my love! Go, now! No! I can't leave you here all alone! Go! Aida! Oh, no! Don't just stand there! No. Arrest them at once! Betrayed my country and my people. Arrest me. He has forsaken his country for love. Oh, but I love Radamis as well. What will I do? Is there truly no way to save him? Get in. Uh, Hurry! I can't go with you. Aida! Aida! So she will sacrifice her life for love. Is it true that you betrayed your country and your people? Speak! 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 Radamis, have you truly betrayed your people and your pharaoh? Speak! Speak! Yes, everything you say is true. How dare he! is a traitor to our country! Bury him alive in the temple of Napata Valley! Oh, it's Radames! He committed treason! Please don't do this. You've been had by the crafty Ida. It's not too late for you. I won't let you go. I'm sorry, Your Highness. I betrayed this country and I love Aida. I'm sorry. But if you don't change your mind, you'll die. Tell them that you love me. Tell them that you love me now. I can still save you if you change your mind. I can save you. I'm a traitor, and I must pay the price. Do you love Ida so much that you would forfeit your life for her? Then it shall be done. So this is where I am to die. Never again will I see Aida or the sun. Nevertheless, I do not regret loving you, Aida. You have 
brought me happiness. Uh, uh, is it you, Aida? It is, my love. What are you doing in here? <sighs> I came here to be with you. I will be with you forever. Aida, ye gods, please accept us. has awakened the sleeping sun. Stolen the sun. Now two suns will shine on your land. Your land will become parched and barren. One sun is enough for us. We will never steal your sun again. Now, everything will return to its place, and peace will reign supreme. After that, the land of the sun never coveted the son of another, and peace returned to the Black Land. The two countries forged a close alliance, and Aida and Radames lived together forever amidst the blessings of all the people in the land. Thus ends my odyssey to find the sun. Oh!